family and uh, three dive buddies went out uh, that day on October 15th and um, two of them were local here with me and one of them was visiting from across uh, Canada on the East Coast and that person had never seen an octopus before and so our goal was to find that person an octopus and so we geared up, got in the water, and uh, yeah, within three minutes, I found this octopus that was just sitting there. It was unbelievable. So we kind of went over around the octopus, uh, giving it some space, but like looking at it, watching it, taking some photos, and and then all of a sudden it crawled over to the person that had never seen an octopus before, and it was just unbelievable. It was so wild, and it started like feeling its arms, or feeling on his arms, and then it crawled up right over his face and on his mask, and oh, I was just like taking pictures because I was so excited for him, and at first it was just coming on my camera, and it was fully fully engulfing my camera. At some point it had crawled like on my body, on my hips and was giving me a hug and it had tentacles up and around uh, my mouth and it was sucking on my lip, which is the only exposed part of my body. I've seen lots of octopus in my diving. Um, this is definitely not, was not a normal encounter with the octopus. Typically when we find octopus, uh, they are in their dens. Uh, so like in hiding in little cracks and crevices and under rocks and in like logs, open logs. So to have it sitting out in the open was pretty rare, um, but even more so to have it just be that interactive and crawling on me and my dive buddy, that's, I've been diving for 12 years. I've never had that. So it was just, oh yeah, it was mind blowing. It was just so incredible. Using this as a source to advocate for protecting our marine life, right? And the being conscious of our waste and, and how it gets into the ocean. So just hoping I can make people through this video aware of what lives under the sea and how um, our effects can be so harmful of what we do.